Installation instructions to install Luxaflex Luminet privacy shears. Two brackets are positioned on the mounting surface so that their centre lines are located 90mm from the ends of the head rail. If more than two brackets are required, additional brackets are spaced evenly between them. To face mount a luminette, it requires a minimum flat vertical surface of 29mm in height. Ensure all brackets are installed at the same height and use a spirit level to check that the shading is perfectly horizontal. Insert two 32mm hex head screws through the opening on the front of the spacer block and tighten. Hook the top of the faceplate to the front of the spacer block and snap into place. The top of the fabric aligns with the top of the installation bracket, not the removable tab on the top of the bracket. The tab serves as a spacer to prevent the brackets from being mounted too close to the ceiling. This tab can be removed if the top of the fabric is finishing lower down a wall. A standard face mount bracket gives 13mm of clearance. Additional spacer blocks, up to a maximum of four, can be used to give greater clearance if required. Tilt the front of the track up so the top groove fits into the locking tab on each installation bracket. With the top groove in place on all brackets, tilt the track down so the bottom groove fits into the locking tabs on the installation brackets. Adjust by sliding the track left or right to centre, then lock the track into place by tightening the locking screws on the bottom of the brackets. Use the wand to rotate the fabric carriers to be perpendicular to the track. Make sure the fabric carriers are in the fully stacked position. Remove the protective wrapping from the fabric, but do not unroll the fabric from the cardboard tube. Stand the tube on its end on a clean surface with the header at the top. Position the tube at the end of the track where the fabric stacks. Unroll the fabric to gain enough slack to attach the poly tab of the first vein to the first fabric carrier. To attach the vein, Insert the poly tab into the pinion until it snaps securely into place. Unroll the fabric as you clip the rest of the veins into the fabric carriers. Attach the swivel plates to the ends of the track. The plates are right and left specific and are marked with an R or L. The rivets attached to the swivel plates snap into the control end and or the swivel arm between the upper and lower clips of the swivel plate. If the fabric is not hanging straight or if veins are not uniform, separate the Velcro fasteners attaching the fabric to the swivel plates and reposition.